Well, my friend, it appears we are the only ones left here. If you're... if you've no other pressing task, would you care to accompany me to Amethy? They are used to lies always seeing those who will imbue the talus with magics. Come, let us join them at once. Sure, let's go there. Oh, this is all making it longer because, like, there is no teleportation shit here. Three more quests. Until a dungeon. The dungeon or the right? Oh. Are you still here? I was like, you're showing off! I thought you're showing off! We need to be in a party. Oh. Thank you very much, mom. Okay. Can we go shopping? Please? To the mall? Let's go straight ahead. Straight ahead, straight ahead, straight ahead. Thank you, mom. Five stars. Oh, good of you to join us. I'm pleased to say we gathered our ample help for the imbuing. With Master Chai in the process of finalizing his design, I've taken the liberty of dispatching all hands off their positions. You heard long as though I have my house in order. Quite frankly, this is the most disorganized mess of a project I've ever seen. I never spent nearly as much time as I would like on my calculations. So, you have proclaimed loudly and fre frequently, Master Chai. Yet from my perspective, a layman's father it may be. Haste notwithstanding, you have gone to great lengths, a bidding by proven me methodology to ensure the integri integrity of the... I hate reading his lines! Boy! Ah! Alright, well, let's just the bare minimum that's expected of us at the stone bricks. Though our glory days are behind us, I've not forgotten our time honored traditions. Oh, but I should mention that the Axtag delivered the one I asked for. Irsi believe he called it. In the quantity, I believe we can fashion a suitable heart of the talus. And then everything will be in readiness, or so I would like to say. Is there a problem? In a talus of, well, any reasonable size, a single heart will serve to circulate ether throughout the chassis. But given the unpre unprecedented proportions of that which we seek to build, I doubt that will be the case. There's better be a really hot bunny behind him. I can't show you, but you have to believe me, there's a hot bunny behind him. By selling smaller peripheral hearts at intervals, I believe that we can maintain a stable at ether flow, thereby solving the problem. However, we don't have enough ore for this part. Do you want it to go and get more ore? Not for I but to procure more, I suppose. Runner, mayhap now is a good time to bring them out. A moment, friends. There is something I would show you. Does he has more ore for us? I say, are these no hearthstones? They are the most prized possession of we of the Knight's Blood, and these belong to our kindred who have left us. Immersed in water imbued with a fervent prayer, these stones harbor no small amount of magic. And we may imbue them with yet more prior to their installation on the talus. So thank you. Being from a different region, these cannot be used for the main heart. The peripheral ones, on the other hand, well, I believe they will serve. Excellent. When Master Matoya spoke to us of the role we are to play, the hearthstone immediately came to mind. Of course, before bringing them with me, I made certain to consult my fellows first. After all, the stones bear the precious lives of those who have gone to the Sunless Sea. But we have now beheld the Sunless Sea with our very own eye. And by the gentle light that glimmers on high, we know that there is peace beyond. Thus are we also at peace. 
Her heartstones may serve to restore night to all the world. Gladly do we give them. Aww. So, Master Chai, if you could instruct us how to distribute the heartstones. And next, for good luck, may I ask that you imbue one as well? Do I have magic? Can I do that? Rest assured, it is not difficult. Simply raise your hand and focus as you would on attuning to an etherite. Imbue the jade colored stone here, if you would be so kind. Sure. I'm doing it. Putting up my hand. The familiar looking heartstone appears to glow faintly. That will do. Thank you, Nick. If this heartstone appears familiar, it is because it belonged to Todia. It bears the collective hope of the Knights Blessed, the hope that none shall ever again be sacrificed to Sin Eaters. Right. I've identified the spots in the talus where the stones are needed. See that they are amply imbued and install them as I have indicated in this di diagram. Are you, are you saying that with my one brain cell I can't focus? Is that what you're saying? Because I'm a bit... I'm a bit insulted by that. Understood. We will set about the task at once. When the talus awakens and the way to Mount Gold is secured, we shall sally forth. It promises to be a crying climb, so take what rest you can in the meantime. We will see you soon. A moment, Ryanji. You said that you would have measures ready in the event that our friend falls to contain to the light. Do you? Do you should I do? All which I require is in this land. So what is the plan exactly? This concerns my health. Fucking tell me. To my deepest regret, I cannot reveal the plan to you. In order for it to succeed, it's vital that you remain ignorant of its nature until the time is right. The plan is simply don't die. Awesome. Yeah, though I made us keep my console. Know that I have only your safe at heart. So rest easy, my friend, and take such ease as you may. The better to be ready for the trial to come. You you you're getting on my bad side, Orianger. I'm told the rock for the chassis is more or less ready. I'll carry it in shape and laid out. It just leaves the MBS to their work. I'll continue checking my calculations up until the very last moment, but it's only a matter of time now. Hi, heart of the party, welcome. Thank you. I'm slaying. While well, slaying the enemy. You managed to rally night every everyone in Norbrook for this endeavor. That's a remarkable feat in itself. Libya enough. Ooh, I want storm blue. Look at my dress. Look how cute I am. I'm adorable. I will die adorably. It's okay. <laughs> There's no point worrying about such things now. I'll get back to my calculations. You, meanwhile, should go and rest as your friend suggested. My wife and the Axe should be in the tavern. Why don't you join them? Oh, an X. Oh, thank you. To the tavern we go. The Axar, you were not said a moment ago, my dear. I would have thought you'd have seen him. He kept me company for a short while. Then he came over rather pale. 
He's literally been straining himself to do a thing. Anyway, he, ex he excused himself, saying that he needed a breath of fresh air. Because he looked, it offered to go with him. He assured me he would be fine. I do hope he's alright. Exarch! Exarch, where are you? Please? I'm going to blue press later, I'm just kind. I want to do the main quest now, honey. I, I, I can't be... I, I don't care about the other. Right now. Mr. Axark, sir, order. Yee! Ow. 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 Okay. There? Where are you? There's a chameleon. A iguana, excuse me for the chameleon, it's an iguana. The exit does not appear to be nearby. Um. Sir? Tribble? Where the hell are you? The exit. Why does the bird have a name? The bird looks so angry. Is that Donald? Donald, Donald, is that you? Is that you? Did I, did I find you? Okay, I need to find the yak though. Okay. I will, he's probably like on top here and like looking at, at that one. Like I could imagine that. Not here? Oh, he has to be. Look, look, he's here. Are you okay? Oh, he collapsed. Oh god, you're not okay. You're not okay, you collapsed! Honey! The future is where my destiny awaits. Weird line to wake up to. <gasps> Forgive me, I was lost in a dream. I needed some fresh air and thought to rest for a moment. It would seem I am more fatigued than I realized. Too much time away from the tower, I fear. It drains me, leaves my body frail and weak. Though, in truth, it is debatable whether I can still call this my body. When first I turned my mind towards the salvation of the world, I came to the conclusion that it would take many long years, many more than remain to me. Oh my god, these stupid bots. And so I made myself one with the Crystal Tower, okay. that I might live indefinitely. I am but an extension of it now. Hence my weakness the farther I travel, and the longer I am away. It has been quite a journey. But thanks to you, the end is in sight. My wish will finally be fulfilled. How goes the construction effort? Then this may be the last moment we have to ourselves for a while. Come, sit with me. I don't think it's a cowboy anymore. <laughs> I take that back. Tell me. When all of this is over, what will you do? I don't know, hopefully live. It's all a matter of the Empire. What I always do is become mighty of foes. Rest. No, I, I still have the Empire to battle, actually. My dress is beautiful. I don't know what you're saying. Uh, yes. 
This is how Even dresses work. Even should succeed in forestalling the eighth umbral calamity, the specter of war will remain. But to declare your intent with such easy resolve, you truly are a hero's hero, my friend. But whatever it is you decide to do, I have every confidence that you will do well. For you have the strength to forge your own path. You will leave countless lives better than you found them, and the souls you touch will never forget your kindness. Then, in trying times, when you question your worth and your choices, they will raise their voices to remind you of the difference you have made. And thus will your deeds come to affirm your path. Remember this. That's a lot of pen- I have really pretty panties though. What will you do when all this is over? Maybe this was not the best outfit when for this, this conversation. When this is over, indeed. I once told you that there are things we can ill afford to lose. Things, I said. Though in truth, I spoke of a person. One who is unaware of the full extent of my plans. Though she deserves to know, I have good reason to keep my counsel. I have come to terms with this in my mind, yet my heart yearns to lay everything bare. For she is my inspiration, and I would give much and more for the chance to speak with her as friends, with no thought of concealment. Should she indulge me with her tales, I would regale her with my own. About my efforts in Norfrent, perhaps. Though, ultimately, that tale is more yours than it is mine. Then, I would ask her about her next adventure. And if she should wish me to be a part of it, oh, how happy it would make me. Together, we would travel the lands and cross the seas and take to the skies upon the eternal wind. My heart swells simply to imagine it. It's the bunny of, of him, isn't it? It's, it's not us. It's, it's the general. But all of this is contingent upon our victory in the coming battle. He's gonna sacrifice himself, isn't he? That's how this is gonna end. The people of this world have entrusted their hopes to us. We cannot fail them. Nor those who roused me from my slumber. Thank you for your company, my friend. Let us return to Amity. I don't know, man. I I got attached to characters, okay? I'm not saying I'm severely attached to characters, but I do get attached to them. Like, I don't want to see them, like, unnecessarily suffer. Sarah came back. Worry not, my friend. I'm much revived for the fresh air. You'll find company, of course. Now then, let us turn our thoughts back to the task at hand. Ay, ay, ay. Okay.
Meanwhile, in the Imperial Palace in the stores. It's been a while we saw those guys. I nearly forgot about them. They also exist. The Radiants have taken the liberty of quashing the wild rumors that your hero is possessed by a devil. With the nation and the grip of war, we may rely on patriotic zeal to prevent them from resurfacing. And what of Emmett Selk? Well, he's with me to be fair, so like, he's not even on this planet. He's taking himself to the first, to usher that world to its end. Or so I believe, he did not disclose the details of his mission, having ever preferred to work alone. However, to those who have known him since the beginning, his actions can prove unpredictable. I'm no stranger to his ways. He joys in playing me for a fool. For fool many times have I been convinced I was acting of my own volition or to discover all was he willed it. My dear grandfather. Oh, the subject of our esteemed colleague. His last report, though brief, did contain one item of interest. You have doubtless wonder if why the signs of the Seven Dawn have not taken the field of light. It's because they are no longer in the source. It took them the whole expansion to figure that one out? The year of the signs has journeyed to the first, as half her comrades, albeit incompl incompletely, their bodies that remain here in the source. This presents an opportunity. If you can defeat the Alliance prior to the Scion's return, you may eliminate their order at the stroke. Are the Scion's gone, none shall remain to thwart our plans. It will be but a matter of striking down the hero upon her homecoming. Which, lest you forget, is essential to the realization of our object, of both of our objects. Through Highlands meddling, her champion threatened to wrest the reins of fate from our grasp. The world is at risk of being dragged down the false path. One which will never see man reclaim his true form. Thus unthinkable that he should supplant us, incomplete as he is. Such a devolution is abhorrent, and it must be stopped before it's too late. The hour has come, your radiance. Order your armies to march once more. Crush all who stands in our way. This is your heart's desire, is it not? To seize a victory that is yours, and yours alone, for the future of Golemond. Oh dear, you do not wear the memories motley well. I was never one to take an interest in tedious conflict. Is it Selk? No. Who is that? Oh, is it is it the one we saw on the battlefield with the chocobo hat? Katana bearing centurion. The whereabouts of my one and three friend Trevor. They interest me greatly. No, it's not. It's one of ours, isn't it? I would hope the beast of this first, uh, providing her proper sport. I would know every detail, Lord Zenus. Uh, would you rather I called you Lydibus? Is another Aston? I'm confused, who is this? It is a chocobo wearing moss dude, isn't it? Huh. Unexpected. Most unexpected. That immortality should be within the reach of one with a burrowed echo. You have adopted yourself, Zenus Gilbus. I 
have no particular attachment to that name, but I am rather fond of that body. If I did, I cannot enjoy my hunt to the fullest. Your secrets are my flesh. I cannot wish you give me first. The choice is yours. Is it Xenus? What? Is that Xenus a soul? Well, how did that happen? Huh? Th that one confuses me greatly. Right, so while the two of you were away, I received word that everything is in place. Meaning, we can proceed with awakening the talents. Once we imbue the magic, it will steer itself and immediately carry out its des designated function. Namely, taking Mongol again aggressive. Come on. Hi, Arjun. That, I, that confused me really well. Everything else up this far, story was like, yeah, I can grasp this. This makes sense. That one? How did that happen? Nix, we may be certain that Valtry will not look on in idleness as we beat a plan to his front door. Once our plan are set in motion, there will be no turning back. So see to your preparations as meticulously as you may, and I will give the order to proceed as soon as you are ready. Is it dungeon time? Give the word and I will rely the order of Akin to the top. Yes. Engage! Let's go! All right, well, let us begin. Let me finally get rid of this stupid, stupid man. Word from the Exarch. All is set on his side, and we may proceed when ready. Well, we have sufficient stone for our needs. Likewise, preparations for the imbuing have been made according to thine exacting instructions. Then you need only say the word. Let us begin. See that everyone is in position. We shall catch Vorthri, mountain and all. Let's go! Didn't I be like closer to the stone talus? Oh, damn. Here it comes! Wait, is this stone tell us building itself together? Wow. Thank you, thank you. I might be coming down with a cold. <laughs> Music is nice now. <gasps> Look his hair!
was really happy to be fair. Ha <laughs> ha! Yes, yes! You've not lost your touch, you clever old bugger! Can we just like build a bunch of these? They seem to be like very effective. Do you see what they're doing? If its hands are damaged, it won't be able to cling to the mountain. Oh, I knew this was a terrible idea. Four three marshals the eaters to his defense. This was only to be expected. Tell me it's fine. We must try and draw as many of them down to the ground as possible. It may not be enough, but we have no other choice. He's 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 acting he's in slow mo, isn't he? <gasps> oh, look! Such a heartless thing our sapling is cold and cruel and heartless! Some of us in times of need, we expressly said, yet what should we find but the final battle joined without so much as a whisper of our name? <gasps> oh, I love her! She's like, bitch, you didn't invite us to war? How dare you! <laughs> oh, she's amazing. Yes, yes, we may also have said that we pay folk have no interest in the struggles of men. But if our adorable sapling had come crying to us for help, we would of course have flown to her aid. Of course we would. What are we to do with her? <laughs> we are so very, very sad. You will play with us. Cheer us up again! Oh look, he finally grabbed the thing. I think they're mad at me, no, thank you. They're probably also mad, but like, you know, let's just not dwell on that. It's okay. This I did not expect, but I will gladly accept the help. Oh, the music I will send changed. word to Yostela and the others. Join them at the foot of Mount Gorg and be ready to make the ascent. Sure, I will do that. Oh my god. It's gonna take us another week, no worries. Barfree's up there for like already like a month or so, it's fine. We don't need to hurry. Uh, where do I have to go? Oh god, I know it. Let me teleport up there and then we're gonna walk with it real quick. Oh, up. Uh. Sorry, so. Thank you, Tama. <laughs> uh, we need to go... Uh, yeah, exactly that way. A tiny bit more to the north? Yes, exactly that. Just keep, keep like that. Uh, it's right here. Uh, does anyone else want to join? Anyone else who is eager to join? Everyone is here, good. Sure you can. Sure you can, you just have to tell me your name in game so I can add you down. Talos has taken hold of the mountain as planned. They will use his body as a bridge to reach Wolf Free Sanctuary. The Sinidus will make us work for everything, y'all, of course. 
But they will carve a path through the wrecks and meet with the masters regardless. Last one there is a rotten egg, let's go! Do your squats. Let's climb that thing. Let's go. Okay, let me see what I got. While we're waiting. One thing about the dungeon, okay. You can't see crap on the floor. So bright okay. Awesome. Question mark. Oh like the AO oh god, okay. That's awesome. Okay, that's a bit stronger than what I have. Okay, I love that. The person who is only using dark mode on every single thing that exists. Wow. Awesome. Okay, let me just see. Um, that one is stronger than this one. Let me just switch that out. But it's also stronger. That was the body. The body. I ignore me getting naked. Everything's good, guys. Oh, because of the cell phone, right. Right. Why, why can I not apply a glamour plate on myself? I look ridiculous now. <laughs> right! But is the reason I can't apply myself? I don't want to go like this into the dungeon! <laughs> Okay, wait. Wait, I have to go back. No, no, wait. Wait, 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 wait. I'm sorry. We have to, sorry. <laughs> I'm back in a second. Wait. What for was it? I have to go find it. Wait, there it is. I can't be seen like that, okay? Let's look. Maybe it's also here. Am I to... Oh, God. No, wait. Am I to party? There we go. Um, okay. I'm coming back, guys. I'm coming back. Give me a minute. I, I had to switch outfits. Sorry, sorry. You know, a girl has to look good if she's slaying enemies. Spoon is there? Awesome. I'm coming to you soon, Spoon. Wait. Wait for me. <laughs> Give me a second. I'll be there in a second. I have to make myself look good, okay? Okay? I'm there in a minute. So. I'm coming, I'm coming. <gasps> You're also funny! Bunny time! Ah, you're a cute bunny! Okay. Uh, invite the party. Oh, you're a gentleman. Okay, anyone, anyone else who wants to join? Or are we, are we full? Can we even be con? Okay, okay, never mind that. Nobody can join. I think it's good. We're full? Good. Let's go! 